At the discovery of a ship that sank off the coast of Colombia 300 years ago is being called the holy grail of shipwrecks. And with good reason, billions of dollars in sunken treasure at the bottom of the ocean are now at stake. Here's ABC's Neil Karlinski. In these first images from the ocean floor, you can clearly see vases, cannons, and what looks like coins. So much gold, Colombia's president making a claim as big as the discovery. Constituye. It is one of the biggest findings and identification of underwater heritage in the history of humanity, he says. The Spanish galleon, the San Jose, sank on June 8, 1708 in the Caribbean off the coast of Cartagena, Colombia. The triple-decked ship was 150 feet long and armed with 64 guns. Estimates of the treasure on board believed to include emeralds, gold, including coins like this one shown on the Facebook page for Sea Search Armada, and silver vary widely, from an astonishing four to as much as 17 billion dollars. Muchas relaciones, pues finalmente. It is a job of many years with many people, says a member of the team, a huge triumph. Un triunfo mayor. Dive teams have kept the exact location of the galleon secret for obvious reasons. It was found in a thousand feet of water during what was very much a high-tech treasure hunt. Tonight, what is thought to be one of the world's most valuable shipwrecks is a secret no more. Neil Karlinski, ABC News, Los Angeles. We thank Neil for that story and we thank you for watching. GMA first thing in the morning and David Muir is right back here tomorrow night. I'm Tom Yamas in New York. For those of you celebrating tonight, happy Hanukkah. Have a great evening. Good night.